2018 70 Kilo World Championship Quarter Final Three. 有请蓝方选手，来自摩洛哥的猛将诺丁本莫。In the blue corner from the Kingdom of Morocco, introducing Nordin Benma. It's all happening here, folks. K. <laughs> that, that, that's me in the book. Sure. You know? Yeah. Dude's such a beast, man. 26 years of age as well. Right future ahead of him. But now is the time. Now is the present. We've already seen Zueb and we've already seen Xing Li head into the semi final. Ben Moore wants to be there as well. And now is his chance. Holding a professional record. 80 wins, 6 losses, 1 draw, and 49 times won by the way of now count. Fighting tonight out of Morocco, Al Mukhtar Makhrib, Nordin Benmar. Again, our host with the most gets all of the accents down perfectly. In the red corner from Georgia, David Kilia. Introducing first. Introducing the fighter standing in the red corner, standing no, 170 no, no, centimeters tall, age 30. His professional kickboxing record, 30 wins, 14 losses, and 14 times won by knockout. He is Ashikara Karat Black Belt, fighting tonight out of Georgia. Introducing David the Hawk Kilia. Well, there you have the Hawk in the red corner. Great shorts. Yeah, I look at that fashion. There you go, the tail of the tape right there. 36, or 30 years old is the Georgian 26 for the Moroccan. And it's all happening here. KLF, Nordin, Nordin, fight, Nordin, 77. Nordin Ben Mo, 180 centimeters tall. Call, David Korea, 170, a 10 centimeter height advantage Ooh. for the Moroccan. And like we were speaking about before, 80 victories, six losses, 49 knockouts for Ben Mo. Yes. 30 victories, 14 losses with 14 knockouts for Kyrgyz. Clearly see the height advantage right sure. there. Clearly see the height advantage. Um, uh, by the way, look at the legs as well. I, I love to do it, when, especially when we're this close. Right leg of Norden is not exactly thick. I mean, you know what I mean? He's, he's standing on uh, two opposite legs. You, you, you notice that? Interesting. Yeah. Good spot there, John. Left leg a lot thicker than the right. This sometimes comes into play with different kickboxers because again, if you're not ambidextrous 100%, well, sometimes you're a shark swimming on land. Because you can't, because you can't be a shark on land. Oh, I see, All right, I get it. That's science, I'm a scientist. Good combination coming in there from Ben Moe, using that left jab and then using it to 
pivot and hook with the left hand again to the body of Kyria and it connects. Oh, spinning stuff, bringing kids through. David, did you notice he uh, he nodded? He got got rocked on the top of the head and he just looked at his opponent and nodded. Yes, yes. Very good. good but watch this knee. rolling thunder. Yeah, exactly, man. <laughs> watch this rolling Oh, good high knee there from Ben Moe. Yeah. I've he always talked about again. that with taller fighters. It's always easier for them to throw that knee because the head of their opponent is not that far away from the knee. Again, for Giria, he would have to jump. Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course. Or find a stepladder. <laughs> Some sort of parachute, <laughs> pulley system. It's all Ben Moe in this opening all round. But again, I, I feel like David is actually playing possum. I do think that he's playing possum because he just gave the nod and he gave a smile before, and that guy doesn't smile. Ever. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> Risky, though, from the Georgian to do this. Yeah. Because with the range the and the power that Ben Moe has, it's... Uh, oh, good left hand there from Kyria. Yeah, ben, ben Moe also, if you guys are not watching, he's cocking the right hand back already. So he's doing the, the high guard, but when he puts that left out there, that's ready to just lightning strike. Oop, and here you go. So David, when, when he just threw right there, very aggressive throws. A lot of torque, a lot of rotation. So again, you can try, tell that he's trying to have a savage, savage, you know, damage-filled blast. Come yeah, from. so we have the uh, combinations there coming is. from Ben Mo against the savage, aggressive one-punch power that Kyrie possesses. Correct. Kyrie again seems to be happy to go against those ropes and beckon in right. and the David, big Moroccan. Yep, David, uh, again, like you just said, so when he threw his jab out, he's not putting any left into it. It's going out like rock'em, sock'em robots. It's just arm, which again is like, uh, it's like fishing, you know what I mean? You're just sure. tossing it out right. there, exactly. falling. But good scoring though for Ben Mo. Yeah. Interesting. Uppercut Especially when we come to the last 30 seconds of the first round, because I feel like David hasn't given anything away. Sure, he's actually probably taken an L in this round because uh, because Ben Mo has gotten the, the ma more mass volume sure. in terms of shots. All output from Ben Mo. But David again doesn't look weary, doesn't look hurt. He actually still looks fresh. He does. Ten seconds. Good right hand there from Kyria. Oh, and again to the body. Rips the ribs. Ben Mo goes that direction as well as we end the first round here at KLF 77. Yes, he, we're going to go to the replay, which is going to show all Ben Mo. But I think it was a really interesting round because I actually do feel like to beat this bank possum. He's covering up. He's not sitting. Light on his feet in the corner right now. Went for the rolling thunder. There were two first things that we saw in that first round. Him getting boxed, him coming up, nodding, and then going rolling thunder. And I, I'm wondering if he's not giving enough, uh, uh, not giving a lo enough love and respect to his opponent, but at the same time, he might be playing it. He might be playing the game. I think you're right, John. I think that they've come in with a, a certain game plan, and that was to let Ben Mo attack, yeah. waste some energy, and now in the second or third round, I'm gonna think we're gonna see the real David Kyria, the Hawk, as yeah. he's known. Yes, exactly. You know who else was named the Hawk? Khabib. Sylvester Stallone <laughs> in Over the Top. Good arm wrestling <laughs> movie. As arm wrestling movies go, that was my favorite. Inside kick from Kyria. Yeah, we start off this right round. Again, you can see the height. Uh, I'm so glad you went back to it because I was just completely skimming oh. over it when we went to the tail of the tape. But Nordin is, again, a much bigger beast than his counterpart right now, Devit. And again, the pawing going out, those those do not hurt at all. That's not taking anything out of his opponent. It's not big damage, but it's allowing him to range and gauge where he wants to go. And now David comes in. You know, in the first bout of the evening, we saw two and off try and move around the ring. This fight, we see none of that at all. They're just no. stuck there like glue in the center of the ring. Because well, I think David is still is still trying to play. I don't know if he wants to take it all, oh, all three solid rounds. Solid left body shot that echoed around this arena. Like you just said about David's movement, now it's just forward backward. He's playing like a tie game. He's hunting for that left hook to the body and he's found it twice already in this round. And I wonder if that's the play, is chop the tree down, you know? Taller guy, sometimes you go to those love handles, you, you hit a liver, you know? Good uppercuts there from Kyria. 
combinations came from Ben Mo, but none of them I feel like actually landed on target. They all How about both. this? Ben Mo is now against the ropes, John. Yeah. Kiri is the one pushing the action. And again, that would be the vice versa to what we saw in the first round. I'm wondering if again that was the uh, playing possum Ali act mode that he was trying to go for. Implement in his favor as he blasts the head back too. So that one was one that landed. I get the, the judges will take these into oh. consideration. Another big one. Solid right hand there from the Georgian. On oh, a left hook. Did deflect off the glove though of Ben Mo. Ben Mo again, huge trunk of a body. Long arms and then the long legs. And I think again that DeVete has probably been taking a lot of uh, a lot of notes. I'm sure he's been practicing a no better practicing partner than Nicky Holskin, who's very Bro. much taller, right? Yep, yeah, he's in that he's in that camp. Team Holskin, no joke, internationally known. Oh! And again, great lateral movement. He stuck it and he moved, and now he's back oh, in there. Beautiful great uppercut. uppercut. Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> Left hook from Kiri, it's all Kiri in the second round. Do you know what I think Ben Mo has to do now, John? He's utilized those long legs. Yeah, he has to go back to the range. Keep Kiri away from you, son. <coughs> Agreed, he has to go back to what he was doing more in the first round, even if that was the playing possum of, uh, of DeVete. It still was where Nadine was uh, a little bit more comfortable. Or looking a little bit more comfortable, I Final say. 10 seconds of the round, the Kiri round in my opinion. Yeah, the Hawk has definitely flown as he comes with another combination that finishes with a kick. End Productive. of round two. Productive work there from the Georgian. David Kiria, the former glory 70 kg world champion in the zone in that second round. One and one, John. Yeah, bro. That's the way that I would have it, in my opinion. Uh, but I, again, still think that uh, David has not really pedaled on his bike. I think that he did get up. And uh, really put it into second gear. We can check out the replay, and that's what I'm talking about. Those are a lot of punches thrown for a big man who might be tiring himself down, and I think that Demit recognizes that. I don't think any of those actually he landed. He did it, you were right. Did Christmas. any connect? And Short arm gestures, but nothing nothing of production there from Ben Moore. Whereas Kyria, yeah, he when, was producing. When he landed, he actually landed flush. We saw him go straight down like you see right there. And let's see how the magic turns out. David Copperfield, magic. Third, and, third and final round. Remember, folks, one of these fighters will advance to the semifinals. And one of these fighters, John? Goes home disappointed. Indeed. This is 2018 KLF 70 kg World Championship quarter final three here in Tongling, China. Kiri is quick. Good left hand to the body. Been ripping that one. Did so in the second round and connected a few times. Already has in the third round. Backing up Ben Mo. Good left kick again to that same point. Ben Mo's right side of the body. He's starting to get battered. And again, look at that. When he throws that hook, it's ill intention. And I think that that again, if he if he creeps one of those through, it's we're seeing lights out. Get the man a pillow. Oh, swing and a miss there from Kiri and Ben Mo was able to counter. Again, nothing much with the legs from Ben Mo, which surprises no. me. Uh, yeah, it's surprising me too. And I, and with the knees, because with the height, he could be just charging into that torso. David, sure. David, I'm loving the style right now, uh, uh, especially again because I'm big with the hands. And the way that he's going in with the hands, he's got the high guard, but he's staying loose in his shoulders. It's not like he's stressed. Ben Mo's rocking and wobbling him. right now. Yeah. Kyrie, whatever he throws seems to be landing, whether it be a body shot, a left hook, a right uppercut, it's all connected. Ben Mo, all sorts of problems for the Moroccan. And I'm saying, uh, David, again, when the ill intention lands, He's going to land with some force as he goes back to the body. Under 90 seconds to go. Good right hand again there over the top from Kyria. What I think kiria has been a master of in this fight so far is he's made oh. it his fight. Snapping right hand there from Kyria rocks the head of Ben Mo. He's made it his fight, John. Yes, he he's has. He's made Ben Mo come into his world. It's and all he's his dominated. Game he's yeah. dominated. 
implemented the game plan, I think, in the first round. I think he wanted to see what it was going to happen. That is, oh, nice low. He almost gave Ben Moore a false sense of security in that first yes. round. That's what playing possum is all about. Hustling. Letting them, letting them think that they got it. And then you just come in. Venus H fly trap. H for Hawk, H for Hustle. Again, so even right there, that left, that wobbled him too. Oh, and, and that right. One. Hands of stone from Kyria right now. Ben Moore wobbling backwards. Looks so much fresher right now. As his opponent covers up, and he, and he I don't know if that uppercut snuck through, but there's been a couple of these that even if they've landed left on the hand, left. Left hand, Ben Moore. He's on DLX right now, John. Yeah. Right hand again. And a left. Ben oh, Moore, yeah. tip four. Yeah. And he's down. Is that down. lights out? Is that lights out? There's a pillow. Where, somebody get a pillow. Oh my gosh. That was awesome, Aaron. He's not getting up. That's it. Kyria going through has just become the favorite to win the tournament this year, in my opinion, John Nutt. Oh, for sure, man. Again, the doctors come in, the medical teams here at KLF, supervision, None of, we don't want any injuries to our athletes, but I'm telling you what, man, the smiles on faces in the corners are as bright and wide as the smile on my face right now because somebody got, just got themselves a pillow sponsorship, maybe a blanket sponsorship, he had to go to sleep. I am in awe of what I've just seen. Kiri in that first round, like we were talking about, was playing possum, just like you said, John. Yep. In the second look, and third, look at the wobble. he took Ben Moe to school. What kind of tree did he fall down like? What kind of tree? Was that a redwood? Is that a redwood lumberjack? It's a Moroccan redwood. A Moroccan redwood. Falling down. And he's still wobbly. Goo is the only thing I could say. That's the adjective I would use. Look Goo. at that. Wow. Highlight reel KO from David Kiria. And if you're watching to have awesome. Arjing Lee, you better get back training because Kiria means business. Bro, he was crisp, he was precise. I, again, I, I swear he played possum the whole entire first round. you got to give props as well to the corner. What a game plan. Executed perfectly by the Georgian. Still getting fanned off. Let's see if he can stand up as we turn it over to our host with the most for your winner and the details of. Oh, he's up. He's fine. Well, again, Good to see.